during the, your darkest time, it's when you're going to grow the most. You are going to experience the most spiritual growth, f mental and physical growth during that time, even though it does not feel like it. Hey guys, how you doing? So, uh, guess where I'm at? I'm at Radio Sangam. I'm about to be interviewed by Martin Morrison. I'm slightly nervous, but I'm doing okay. I'm just waiting for him to arrive. Um, you know, it's just weird when every time they say, oh, award-winning motivational speaker. <laughs> I'm gonna get out of the car, actually. It's too hot. It's too hot! <laughs> I am in Radio Sangam studio with the awesome Martin Morrison. I, every time I say Morrison, it's like, let's go Morrison. <laughs> Sorry, mind. pardon my joke. <laughs> it's all right, it's been a scream. I'm just glad you didn't introduce me as Grandad Morrison. <laughs> yeah, I was almost tempted. Private joke, private joke. But listen, I'm, I'm really grateful to my dear for coming on to the show. You've got a great story, my dear. Um, what an inspirational lady. Um, you know, if you're following her, I hope you get to see her on stage. I hope you get to hear her story if you haven't heard it already. I think that people like my dear who have been able to overcome so much and transform from the inside out, they're able to transform, transform others. And that's what it's all about. <music> I ended up on a stage in front of over 100 people and I stood and I shared my story and you know what's so amazing about it people afterwards coming up to me and they said I was crying with you everything is always working out how it should be looking back all those years, my hardships, losing my dad and all of these hardships, I am so grateful that I had it. I am so grateful. Now, it's not something that you hear from someone who says, I'm so grateful that my dad passed away the, the way that he did. I'm so grateful that I became a carer. I'm so grateful for my anxiety and depression because those are the things are going to help me to help other people. Brilliantly said, and the sign of someone who's truly spiritual. So guys, I've just done um, with the interview now, and um, honestly, I'm absolutely buzzing right now. Um, the experience was incredible. Martin Morrison is such an awesome guy, and um, you know, when I spoke to him uh, prior to coming on air, um, it, it just it just felt like the universe is uh, aligned me with this guy. And I mean, you know, he talks about consciousness, spiritual awakenings, and things like that. Now, this is an interview that Martin actually made me dig deeper into my memories and um, and speaking about them. For a, for a while, it was emotional, but I kind of love interviews like this because um, it makes you go deeper into exploring yourself as a human like the challenges that you face the challenges that you overcome in life it's great to be putting uh, yourself out there I, i'm so grateful to be able to experience that i'm so grateful to be able to share my story um so other people know that it is okay to uh, be vulnerable, it is okay to uh, share your story with the world. Right, guys, I'm gonna he head home now and get something, something to eat, and just chill out. <laughs> um, so, because I've been talking for like two hours, and um, yeah, so I will speak to you soon. Bye, peace and love.